this is my travel buddy today. Here's my week as a flight nanny. This is the toughest part of my, my job, you guys. Good morning. I was home for exactly 12 hours last night, and now I'm here waiting for my Uber driver, and he's gonna take me to the John Wayne Airport where I've got a puppy waiting for me, and we're gonna be flying all the way to JFK, New York today. So I'm gonna bring you along so you can see our adventure. Uh. Yeah. This is my travel buddy today. She's an English bulldog and we're going to JFK, New York. Isn't that right, baby? Yeah, you wanna say hi? To get her all settled in her pet carrier and then go check in with Delta. Happy Tuesday! I'm taking a short Uber lift over to the LaGuardia Airport for my next flight. My next flight is from LaGuardia to Memphis, Tennessee. I am picking up a sweet little Boston Terrier puppy who is hey. going to spend the night with me tonight. Here is the part of the night where I try to play with oh, sweet yes. Lila so that she Sounds will good. fall asleep. But I have to be careful I don't do it too early because I don't want her waking up in the middle of the night. I want us to sleep all the way through to the night until it's time to get up for our early morning flight. Even though I brought these toys with us to play with, all she wants to do is chew on my fingers. And even though I brought this comfy blanket, all she wants to do is cuddle in my lap.
ran into another flight nanny while I was at the Denver airport. This is Alexandra, and she owns Wagon and Walkin' Flight Nanny based in Tucson, Arizona. After dropping off Lila in Denver, I took a quick flight back over to San Francisco. I have to drive to pick up some bunnies, and then I'm driving right back towards the San Francisco airport so we can prepare for an early morning flight. Can you guess where these two little bunnies are going? We're going to Vegas, baby. Do you guys want to see the cutest effing puppy I've ever met? There it is. There she is. This is Maya. And she's gorgeous. And she's my friend today. We just have a day trip. We're in Atascadero, California. Bye. And she's going to her new mom in Quartzsite, Arizona. You ready? Go, baby. Sure, she went out of this bag. But we can't do that while I'm driving. So sweet. So, I can't handle it sometimes. I can't handle it. Like, how, how beautiful. How sweet, how fluffy, how cuddly. Oh my goodness. I think I'm gonna keep this one. What do you think? My house is on the way. We can just like, you know. You would never know the difference. I could be your new mom. <sighs> this is the toughest part of my, my job, you guys. Wanting to keep all the puppies. Yeah, because this one has stolen my heart. Absolutely. You're going to break my heart, aren't you? Bye. Bye. Yeah, let's go meet your mama. I guess I, I can't keep you forever. But I can pretend you're mine for just the next eight hours. How's that? I would be okay with that if you're okay with that. Yeah, agreed. Deal. Next eight hours, you're mine. Hi, baby. Did you get a little car sick? The little baby got a little car sick. So we're just taking a break, cleaning everybody up. Yeah. Look at what a good girl she is going pee on the pee pad. Cause she's such a good girl. Yay. Doggy in the camera, who is that? How did I get this darn lucky? 
travel with this beautiful lady. Your ears slip. Can I flip it for you? Girl's gotta help a girl out. Time to say goodbye to sweet Maya and rest up. Tomorrow morning, I have a very special travel partner. I have a flight from Tucson, Arizona to Seattle, Washington, and I'm helping two lovely ladies move. This is Sophie, and I'm traveling with Sophie and her mom, Judy. Judy just needed an extra hand on this flight. She's making a big move and knew that having a companion for Sophie would take a lot of stress out of her travel day. I am so grateful that I got to lend a hand for their big move. And now it's time for home. I'm home. My heart is full. <laughs> I'm about to take off these boots and burn them. I'm going to devour this Panera salad that I just got and binge the last few episodes of The White Lotus. But I just wanted to say thank you so much for sticking around this long, for watching all of my travel adventures. If you haven't subscribed yet, um, why not? Well, there's a whole world of puppies and kitties and bunnies waiting for you if you just click that little button and subscribe. I'm gonna rest up now until I start my next adventure in about two days. Thank you guys so much and I'll see you in the sky. Look at how little. I definitely slept here at the airport. Oh my God.